Throughout Hunter Hunter, we've been focused on Gon Freaks' goal. Yes, Gon Freaks' goal, and that's the big thing because he's the main character, so it's not a surprise. But his goal is to find Jing Freaks, and when that happened, honestly, it was kind of a shocking moment because I thought that would be an end goal thing where, like, finally at the end of the story, Gon finds Jing. But it was more like, okay, this goal is finished, now we're on to better things. And seeing goals change as the story goes, you have to applaud Hunter Hunter. Now, I do want to say this. It is kind of a main purpose of finding Jing throughout the story, but it's also sprinkled with Kurapika's revenge and his vengeance, which is now getting a highlight in the manga. If you're an anime only, you guys should check out the manga. I'm not going to spoil you guys. I Trust me, I won't spoil you guys, but still, I think you guys should check out the manga. I'm, there might be a little bit of spoilers at the end of the video, but I'll give you guys warnings, of course. And Kurapika's vengeance for his people. But I asked today, what is the former Zodiac? Yes, Jing Freaks, the for former Zodiac uh, member. What is his uh, true purpose? What is his true goal? Because right now, let's be honest here, he's entering the Dark Continent. So that's definitely a goal he's kind of been teasing at the end of the anime. But what is his true goal? What is he actually looking for? That's the question I have today. At the end of Hunter x Hunter, Jing reveals the Dark Continent. Uh, to go on freaks, the kind of the origin of the Chimera Ant. This is the craziest era in the Hunter Hunter story, and he even said that he's not even qualified to enter. So that showcased that Jing really wants to enter here because Jing is not qualified, he wants to get in there. You honestly, so definitely, I think the Greed Island connection, honestly. That could be a situation of uh, him being so boxed into the world of Hunter Hunter and wanting to go to Dark Hunter so badly to see the true world, Green Island. That could be a, uh, an answer to that, honestly. But still, I definitely think that Jing Freaks revealing the uh, origin of uh, the Karma Ant, the Dark Continent, all that crazy stuff for the future plot points to Gon showcase that Gon and Jing really have a true purpose in the Dark Continent. Both these characters, father and son. So I'm hyped. I'm excited. Now, spoiler alert for an anime only. I I will discuss some manga events now. Uh, I definitely will say that these events are not that huge of spoilers. Honestly, okay, they're spoilers, but like, let's be honest, with you. I'll give you, I'll give you some. I'll keep it real with you guys, yo. Ned and Mac, I'll keep it real with you guys, yo. Read the manga, yo. You're gonna think, oh man, I, I made a mistake not reading this manga sooner, yo. Read it, enjoy it. It's not gonna ruin the anime experience, honestly, it won't. But Jing Freaks and Pearson Hill are going head to head in the manga right now. Both have spooky relationships with Netro. Pearson had kind of a rivalry where he kind of hated Netro, but that hatred kind of was a weird, sick way of love. That was the weirdness. And Jing Freaks and Netro definitely, that was a respect there, yo. Jing really respected Netro, and that's why he kind of was using the same tactic. Tactics of Netro, very cunning in the actual election arc. I definitely want to say that I want to see a flashback between Netro and Jing, especially a prime, like okay, we can't see a prime Netro, but a younger Netro and a younger Jing deal. Because i seen uh, Netro joke around with Gohan and Killua when they were little kids in the beginning of the Hunter exam, I mean, during the Hunter exam. I think that might have happened when it comes to Jing and as he got older, yo. This guy, Jing, is a very, very high up hunter, yo. He's a top five Nen user, so I definitely am excited to see if they do a flashback. But still, Pearson and Jing, they're at each other's heads right now. And I definitely think that the purpose of Jing Freaks definitely has Pearson Hill connection right there. And they might battle in the future, who knows? Now, before I tell you guys what I think Jing Freaks' true goal is, I do think that Jing and Gon might have a battle situation where they fight. Now, will they be both in the right state of mind who knows the dark continent has so many different weird things they could both be not the same gone and jing that we know and love today well some people actually hate jing free so for being a bad father yo a lot of people hate him for that i've seen fam fans hate him for that but i still want to say this yo gone does not look at jing as a father that's what he said yo uh and that's what was, was a very very uh, very important quote that gone had so i definitely excited to see if they do have interactions in the dark continent later on but who knows i do think that jing free is now taking the mantle of the main character in a sense well he's not really the main character but the main purpose of the story he's trying to take he's trying to take that mantle and i think that will be brought back to going later on in the future but right now jing is taking that goal and i think his goal is to see dawn freaks so he has never even seen dawn freaks and dawn freaks is right now chilling in dark continent i think he wants to know answers about his family we know some crazy stuff happened to uh, mito's parents jing freaks his father why are these, these things happening? I think Dom Freaks and Jing will be something that connects these crazy deaths that happen or missings that happen to these parents, these people that are really cherished to Jing Freaks. So I'm excited to see what's going to go down. It's going to be real. It's going to be real. And Jing's true goal 
might completely shock everyone. Our ankles can, can, can be completely broken. Yes, broken. I said it. <laughs> Tell me your thoughts in the comment section. What do you think about Jing's Freaks is true goal? I want to see, see all you guys' thoughts. Like and share if you enjoy. Like and share only if you enjoy. And subscribe for more Hunter Hunter content. I'm Nen Mac and I'm gone.